Hey guys, how's it going? We are back and welcome to a type of video that I have never actually done before. This is a money-making special video. Uh, I wish I could claim that I had discovered this money-making method myself, but I do have to give big props and a big shout out to Ghosty. I'm gonna put his name up on the screen right now so that he can get the full credit that he deserves for this. He introduced this money-making method to me about a week ago and it's brought me about a million GP so far since and I've only done it for maybe maybe six hours in all honesty. We've run the math and if you focus on it, uh, you can actually get an inventory completed in one minute and 11 seconds. Uh, even if you round that up to two minutes for you know accounting for lack of run energy and just AFKing and being inefficient, this method is still, as a free to play player with no stats, 200 plus thousand GP an hour. And that is buying wooden shields. Literally all you have to do to make money with this method is buy wooden shields from Cassie's shield shop or whatever it's called in Falador. Uh, you're going to see quite a lot of that on the screen. I'm just fast forwarding through a, a clip of me doing that actually. Uh, you buy, buy them for five GP each and the GE will buy them for upwards of 200. You can even occasionally sell them for 400. I have absolutely no idea why these things sell for so much. They're literally the worst shield in the entire game, but for some reason they sell for 200 GP. My speculation and what I've heard from other people is it might be for collections. People like to collect these type of items because they're kind of weird. They're not very useful. Kind of like collecting bronze daggers and that kind of stuff. But regardless of that, it's very, very, very good money for uh, free-to-play players and something. I, I would put it up against Zamorak Wines. If you can find empty worlds and world hop, Zamorak Wines are more efficient for money-making than this. But literally no other method that I've found in the game for a free-to-play player so far is as good of money, except Zamorak Wines if you can find worlds that aren't botted, which is a big caveat. Now, if you're watching this video, I would recommend trying to do this as soon as possible because I don't know how long it's going to be viable. I honestly wouldn't have announced this or made a video on it unless it was going to be revealed. And unfortunately, I actually decided a few days ago that I wasn't going to do anything about this or make a video special for it, I suppose. Uh, and then I realized on my current series, my free-to-play series uh, that I have going right now, a link for that will be on the screen right now, it was going to be revealed either way through that, so I figured I should make a special video for it and just draw attention to the fact that through merching, I mean this isn't even flipping in all honesty, but just through merching and having knowledge of the GE, you can make a boatload of money as a free-to-play player. Things like Zamorak Wines aren't the only way to go. I, like I said, I've made about a million GP from this so far, and I've only been doing it for about six hours. And those are six inefficient hours. I could probably have close to, you know, 1.5 mil if I'd really sat down and focused on it. But uh, as any of my viewers will know, I'm a very AFK player. But yeah, unfortunately, I do imagine this will be botted at some point. Just make sure you report those bots, get them out of there as soon as you can, because hopefully this will still stay profitable for some amount of time. But yeah, as far as I have found, this is quite possibly the most efficient uh, GP per hour money money making method in the game. Uh, like I said, comparable to Zamorak wines, but those are so heavily botted at this point that it's almost difficult to get them, uh, especially if you're not on the 500 total worlds. And if you are on the 500 total worlds, you're going to have to wait for them to respawn anyways. So yeah, taking quite a chunk of time there. But really guys, I mean, I wish I could pad out this video and make it 10 minutes long to get the ad revenue and all that stuff, but that's all there is to say. I won't keep you guys too long. There's really nothing else to it. Just buy wooden shields and sell them. It's lit That's how easy it is to make 200 plus K an hour in this game. So yeah, figured I would make a video just bringing attention to this. There's not much else to say, so I won't waste any more of your guys' time. Go do this, go make some money. Uh, yeah, I realize also, by the way, this is not very good money at all for members, but for free-to-play players, if you're out there and you're free-to-play, you know how good of money this is. Anyways, guys, if you are going to go give this a shot, make sure to leave the video a like. Again, props to Ghosty. If you're new to the channel as well, make sure to subscribe to it. I post all sorts of free-to-play content, a little bit of members content every now and then, but most of the time it is free-to-play. Uh, and yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Hope you've enjoyed this insight into how I make most of my money in game lately. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.